day in the Ursus with four people on board. All right, copy. Have a good day on the water, 9 to 1. Today we are headed out to a remote area of Yellowstone National Park to handle and call our grizzly bear that was captured earlier this morning. To understand how these incredible animals live, move, and survive, the Interagency Grizzly Bear Study Team has been leading one of the most in-depth wildlife monitoring programs in the world. The team brings together biologists and managers from federal, state, and tribal agencies, all working together to make sure all grizzly bear conservation and management activities are rooted in solid science. Once the bear is safely mobilized, we collect DNA samples, check bear's overall health, and fit it with a lightweight GPS collar. This collar will track the bear's movements for up to two years before it drops and we're able to recover it. The data collected is incredibly valuable. It tells us where a bear goes, where they den, what types of habitats they use, and how they respond to things like wildfires, droughts, or human activity. Okay, 550.2. Oh, 550.2, okay. Pad plus toes and claws. 15.7. Each collar adds to a long-term data set we have been building since 1975, helping us track trends in survival, reproduction, habitat use, and where conflicts tend to occur. All of this helps us make smarter decisions, not just for bears, but for the entire Yellowstone ecosystem that they shape. I'm Travis Wyman, bear biologist with Yellowstone Bear Management Office.